Chef Clark, he's uh, I'm the branch chief. Content branch chief. He's worked uh, at Fort Calhoun or directly with it since 2007. I heard him say that was our question. How many other members of the panel and for how long have they had experience with Fort Calhoun? Have they had a long standing familiarity with the. the You're talking the 350? The, the, the 350 oversight panel, the members of that. How much uh, prior experience do they have with Fort Calhoun and this type of reactor or other types of reactors? Again, several questions in there. Uh, let, yes. me, let me take them one at a time if I could. Uh, the, the first one is there's seven panel members on the main chapter of three fifty panel. With the mix, we have uh, folks that are from uh, that are stationed here at the, the facility. Uh, John Kirkland is the senior resident. He's the guy in the blue shirt over here. Uh, John is the senior resident at the, the facility. Um, myself. Um, John has been at the facility for like five years. He's been a uh, resident and senior resident uh, at uh, Fort Calhoun. Uh, as I've stated, I've been directly associated with Fort Calhoun since 2007. Uh, there's uh, another uh, regional uh, senior manager uh, on the panel that's uh, Chris Kennedy. He's back there in the blue shirt with the, the logo. Uh, he's actually the chairman of the, the panel. Uh, and, uh, he has experience dating back uh, quite some time to Fort Calhoun. Uh, he was actually in my position as the branch chief of Fort Calhoun probably about a decade or so. Uh, so there's some experience going back in the region to that. We also have uh, folks from headquarters. We have a city manager uh, from headquarters who's in the inspection and policy. Uh, group. We also have the uh, project manager from uh, that's Lenia Wilkins, who's standing right back here, the, the young lady over here, that's uh, in charge of overseeing the, the actual licensing type of aspect. And then we have uh, two other members, uh, one from the region and one from, from headquarters. Again, we did so to give a variety of different uh, looks, responsibilities, uh, procedural, policy type of thing. So, that as a panel, collectively, we can make those kind of decisions and what's the most appropriate type of thing to do for inspection.